Hey guys, what is going on? It is Obadiah and we are back today playing some Ark Survival Evolved on the Scorched Earth map. And today I wanted to get us started doing something that um, I really enjoy doing. We haven't done on this map yet, which is getting the artifacts. There's like three new artifacts, I think. So I want us to get one today, kind of go uh, explore a cave. I think I already know where one is. I've been leveling up my saber that we got. Um, I got him up to almost 4,000 health. 1,000 stamina, I upped his weight as well so I can carry more supplies and just over 300% melee. I got a bunch of extra armor, got sleeping bags, I got a bunch of cooked meat because uh, I went ahead and made uh, a uh, S-Structures Plus Industrial Grill. Whoa. See, there it is. Which is really cool because the Structures Plus stuff, you can switch to gas or electricity um, which is just fantastic. Just awesome. I love it. Um, and also, I, and I can pick it up and move it, too, if I do decide to put it somewhere else, which is great. So I spent a lot of time building up uh, some materials. I have got rockets. I've got nine homing and six regular, two rocket launchers. Got two crossbows with a bunch of the new flame arrows, which are awesome. Flamethrower, chainsaw, fabricated sniper rifle, long neck. Unfortunately, they're just primitive. Because I haven't found any really cool blueprints yet. But uh, it should be enough to get us going. And we got all sorts of stuff. And hopefully this will be enough to get us through one of these caves. So, um, so I'm going to go ahead and head over to one of the caves. Kind of get in. Get get uh, get things moving. And I uh, will bring you guys back when we are over there. Alright guys, we are at the entrance to the cave where the artifact of the crag is. I believe that's the one that's here. And, uh, oh man, we got super heat going on. That's just my most favorite thing in the whole world. Okay, let's stay underground here. If you want to know where the entrance was or is, it's kind of difficult to find. Um, hard to see from the air. But it is about, well, it looks like 3027-ish. Uh, I never know where to look at the brown pin or the yellow me on the map. But that's about where it is. It's about 3027-ish. Um, it's kind of a dangerous area, and I did see a wild wyvern. And unfortunately, I can't stick the um, our wyvern any closer uh, or any further in the cave than he is right here. It's as far as I'll let him go. So we're going to go ahead and set him to neutral and hope he's here when we get back. I did lay down the sleeping bags because this is the spot where those things go. Let's make sure all of our guns are locked and loaded. And uh, we'll go ahead and get in here. I'm hoping we can just use just the saber for everything. Uh, what am I missing off my hotbar? I just pulled something off. Let's throw the whip back on there. And uh, we should be good to go. I thought this was locked and loaded already. Consumed. Okay. So here we go. Our first cave of the map. So far it's pretty easy, I've got to say. Okay, what do we? What is that? It's a rock. Oh, also we had to take off the improved spyglass from our servers because it was all crashing servers and stuff. We're gonna re-add it back. I think it's fixed now, but uh, that's why I have to use this regular old lame spyglass. Okay, there's some stuff over there. Is there two paths? No, that's water. Ooh, maybe we take this opportunity to refill our our canteen. Perfect. All right. So what's over here? Wolf. Wolf who has seen us now. Where'd he go? Some scorpions. Let's see how good these fire arrows do. Oh, they don't go that far. Let's aim a little higher. Uh too high, too high, too high. Got him! Because... Oh, see, that's not too bad. I plan on taking it nice and slow. Don't want to lose my saber. And don't want to, uh... I wonder if this thing will be a little better for this. Don't want to lose my saber. I want to keep him alive. 
And I also want to see if you even how difficult these things are to kill and how hard it is to do these things on foot. Um, but the saber is definitely here because I'll probably end up needing him. Was that a spider there I didn't even see? The only downside is I do feel like I'm already using way too much ammo. Alright, let's hop on this guy. Let's get it. Let's just get in there. Oh, there's a, uh... And we missed. Ah! That was a mantis. Okay, we need to find... Land. There's a little bit of land. Oh, there's a rock guy. Oh, there's a rock guy in the water. Well, that is what I would call not an ideal situation. All right, let's get up here. All right, I forget. Did the bats attack me or do they attack my guy? Oh, this is bad. This is already a terrible, terrible idea. We already made huge mistakes. No going back now. Oh, I hate Onik. I need him like cornered. Okay, let's try to turn it around. Let's go this way. Okay, so this is the jump that we missed right here. And oh, there's two paths. All right, come on, suckers. Why are these guys dying? Oh, the rock guy's still here. Please go back to your magical rock form. We're running. We're running. Uh, 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 meat. Force feed. Ugh. If the rock guy would go away, we'd be fine. I just can't hit these things. There we go. Ooh, for a second there when we were a little higher. I know there's like a way to like corner them and stuff, but I am honest, not honestly just bad at it. Okay. No, you, you stay on passive. I don't need you running away from me because you think because you think that you know what's the right thing to do. Alright, now we're going to stop. Let's use the raw meat first because we're going to get tons of that and we're going to heal this guy up. Alright, so so far so bad. Um, Onik, Onik are like the thing of my nightmares. Let's just... I feel like they used to die way easier than this. Or at least on the center they die way easier than this. Are they like buffed in these caves now or something? I feel like you used to like one-shot them. Okay, there. Yeah, stay down here. Stay down here where I can get you. It almost feels better just to stay in place and try not to do anything else. Because they fly right in front of me and I can bite them a few times. Where'd you go? There you are. Come back. Yeah, see, so you can get like three good bites in there. Come on! <laughs> what? Reload! Why won't we reload? Okay. Well, that was terrible. I'm just gonna sit right here in this corner. God, about time we finally killed that thing. Alright. That was just an absolute nightmare. So, it did look like there were two paths. Oh, this one just drops down. Which is what I'm guessing is the other path, but let's go around the other way and... And see if that's the case. The only problem is we're gonna have to run right. Ooh, we got a level. We're gonna have to run right by. Let's bump that a bit. Uh, I think we're gonna have to run right by that rock golem guy, uh, or rubble golem. I think they are when they're the little ones in caves. Not a hundred percent sure. Um, we'll let this guy heal up a bit. We're probably just gonna run straight past it because I mean we can't fight it. We do have some rockets, but we don't need to waste like all of our rockets fighting one little rock or uh, rubble golem guy. And it's like the beginning of the cave still. Um, oh, sec, there, there he is. We're running into him. Literally running into him right now. That was terrible. Just let us past! 
Okay. There we go. Now we can just keep running. So is this... Yeah, I think we were up there. And we just dropped down down here. Alright, we can kill some spiders. so shouldn't be a problem. I don't think they'll be come anywhere close to knocking our guy out. Sweet. Alright, we out of battle. Alright. There's a wolf, some manti. Let's see how smart those manti are. Because if they will just stay down there and try to attack me this way, whoa! They can jump really high, can't they? I wonder if I can just take them out from here or if they're going to come around the top. Alright guys, so I am definitely in the market for a new recording software if any of you guys have any good recommendations. I'm using OBS right now and it keeps, it's constantly, constantly crashing on me now. Um, I don't know why, it just started a couple days ago. Um, let's see if those guys will stay down there so I can just shoot them from above like this. Maybe with a fire arrow? Whoa! Yeah, it didn't seem to do anything. I thought it would, even if I just like hit the ground, I thought it would just burn them. Yeah, there we go. Burn, baby! Damn, these things do a good amount of damage. I mean, look at that. Killed a mantis. Oh, so you have to hit him. You can't hit the ground near him. Like so. I think that'll take him out just like that. So it's just some more sabers. Get out of my way. Can you just die? Thank you. So, are all the Manti dead? Did we kill? I thought, I thought there were two of them. Because if they are... Alright, we should be good just to hop down there on our saber. We can take out the last couple of these saber guys. Ah, it shouldn't be a problem at all. Huh? Oh, that's one. And... This one seems to be stuck on the wall. Oh, there's three! Oh, he's straight up in the wall, though. Can we get him? Sure can. Well, he keeps knocking us back real good. I just don't want him getting out of the wall and chasing after us in a bit. There we go. Alright. Oh, now there's two paths again? Don't make it a maze. Just give me a path. Alright, let's go up. Okay, let's kill this guy first. Okay, let's get on the loop. And now we get to have the super long battle where I sit here and don't and just not hit them for like 45 minutes. All right, where is this gonna take us? So is that the other path right there? Oh, freaking on it, coming out everywhere. Oh, and spiders, but we can deal with spiders. Not super worried about those guys. And the thing is, the Onik aren't even hard either. Like, they're not hard to kill. They're just little dumb bats. They just are so irritating. Okay. Let the web go away. Alright. So far, this hasn't been too difficult. Oh, hey. Hey there, bud. Manti do a lot of damage, though, but they seem to be pretty easy to kill. Uh, let's watch the Topor. Yeah, we have tons of Topor. Shouldn't be an issue. All right, guys, so my recording software crashed, and then I went and re-recorded, and it crashed, and now this is my third time re-recording this, but I wanted to come back to show you guys the rest of the way. So when I last left off, we were right here killing some spiders and uh, bats, I believe, uh, and I so you just keep following this path down and around, and we did learn that uh, the other path we saw up top is the same path as this one. It leads to the same spot. It comes out right here. 
So this way might be a little shorter, but it doesn't really make a difference. There was a rock guy here, a rubble golem, but he fell in the water. You probably see him down there somewhere. Um, you just gotta make this little jump, which is remarkably easy. And follow this around. Um, there's really only one way to go. It gives the illusion there's multiple paths, but there's not. In this room, there were maybe uh, some bats up to the left, some bats right here, and you can see the artifacts straight ahead. There were also uh, a couple scorpions and a wolf, uh, maybe a saber. Not a whole lot to deal with. If you go to the left, there's nothing, just ends. So you gotta go down here to the right. And then uh, see some really cool bones. There was a wolf stuck in the bones we had to go kill. So don't forget that guy. He might sneak up on you. And here there were, uh, I think there were two Onic, two Scorpions, and then two Mantis. The Mantis were like hidden up to the left. Couldn't see them. I, I shot the other stuff on the way in. But nothing too difficult. And then we also found this really awesome, cool skeleton thing in the wall. And the artifact, which I don't think we can take because we already have two. Uh, but every time we open it, it does have this scorched torch skin. Not really sure what that is yet. Um, so, we got two of the artifacts now. We've got one on our saber and one on our, us. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Hopefully this time the recording sticks and I don't have to do this another time. Because it's getting a little out of hand. Um, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and get back to base. If you guys know of any other recording software, please let me know. Because I don't really know that much about it. And uh, I'm using OBS right now, but I'm open to check out other stuff. Alright guys, we are back at base. And I want us to go ahead and up here and throw down our... Uh, I built a little trophy base. We can throw it right here. So we can see what the artifact looks like. Okay, kind of cool. Looks kind of like a fancy grappling hook. Don't they normally rotate? Why isn't it rotating? Huh, interesting. Um, also, I did go ahead and make a torch so we can play with the torch skin. Let's take a look. Okay, it's just uh, like a regular torch, but they put some little compy head skulls on it or something. All right, well, nonetheless, cool. It's better than nothing. So, definitely cool. But anyway, guys, I do think that's going to be it for today. Uh, it was a burly day. I know it was only like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes for you guys. But, man, everything kept crashing for me. I'm having some technical problems. I need to go update some drivers and try to figure out what's going on. Um, anyways, guys, oh, where did I drop the saber? Oh, there he is. I really do appreciate you guys coming to hang out with me, as always. Uh, if you did enjoy the video... Uh, or if you learned something, go ahead and do me a favor and hit that like button. And of course, if you're new, always feel free to subscribe. Uh, <laughs> I would love to have you on our channel. Uh, if you do have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments section below. Also, hit feel free to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, uh, even Google Plus I have going on. I post some stuff there every once in a while. Uh, all the links are in the description. But anyways, guys, for now, I do think that's going to be it. And I will see you guys again next time.